Hello, thank you for watching this video. Uh, in this video, we will talk about the new PSU and the feedback about the product. Uh, first, we introduce the 1200 watt PSU. Uh, this. You can see it doesn't look uh, different with our other PSU, but it is here. You can see it is 1200 watt PSU. It is designed and produced by our factory. Uh, the PSU before is made by other manufacturer. Uh, we just do aging test before sending them out. Uh, but there is still PSU damaged after some customers receive them. So in this way, so in this way, uh, our boss want to make the PSU by ourselves to control the quality. Um, considering the different voltage uh, you use to power on the PSU, there is still a switch here. There is a steel switch on the PSU, which you can use for different AC input. Uh, if you, uh, it is default to one, 220 volt AC gear. So if you live in the area where 110 AC is uh, used, please move the switch to the 110 volt AC gear. As we talk about the AC input, uh, the output power is different under uh, different AC input. You can see the, here is the technical parameter. The output voltage is same, uh, 68 volt. The current is different. Uh, if you use 220 volt AC, you can got 17.7 uh, ampere max. But if you use uh, 110 volt AC, it is 14.7 ampere max. Uh, so under 220 volt AC import, it is 100. Uh, 1200 watt output. Uh, but if you use uh, 110 volt AC input, it is just about 1000 watt output. You can consider it as an advanced version of our 1000 watt PSU. Uh, you can check the technique parameter uh, chart here. In this way, if you use 220 volt AC input, it is enough for uh, RD6018 for output. But for RD6024, uh, this 1200 watt PSU can only let uh, RD6024 about 1100 uh, watt due to the efficiency. If you use a uh, 110 volt AC input uh, for RD6018 or RD6024, uh, both of them can only output uh, 950 watt max due to the efficiency uh, reason. Uh, so please consider if you need this PSU uh, before the purchase, according to the AC input you use. Okay, I got some feedback. Uh, I just wanted to say that please calm down, calm down first uh, when you meet the problem and just tell us what happened. Uh, we will help you until the problem is solved. Uh, one buyer said that the component is missing and he make a dispute for the order uh, want to refund the order uh, but actually uh, he finds the accessory pack on the desk 
So when he opens the box, uh, he drops the pack on the desk, but he does not find it. Uh, so just come down and check the accessory. If there is something missing, just tell us. No need to uh, make a dispute first. And there is another buyer uh, who uh, receive the products and uh, immediately he leave a uh, one star feedback uh, leave over 100 words to describe how bad we are and uh, through private message he uh, still uh, use some words which is not so pirate uh, and finally find out there is nothing wrong with his order but the feedback cannot be changed so the one star feedback is still there uh, you can have a look so after he finds the, that there is nothing wrong uh, he had to leave an additional comment to correct the feedback so when the problem happened just calm down first no need to lose your temper and talk with us uh, we will help you if it is product problem, uh, we will make up for you. Uh, if it is operation problem, we will tell you the correct operation way. Uh, yeah. No need to uh, lose your temper. Uh, just calm down. Okay, that's all. Thank you for watching.